Hey Logan, you should be doing your history. What are you doing on your phone? You know phones aren't allowed here. Well, Zelma was on her phone. I don't give a fiddler's fart if Zelma's been on her phone. The question is, why are you violating school rules of being on your phone? You should be working on your history essay. Well, you're violating school rules all the time because you sit on your desk on the phone when you're not teaching. There's been a time that a teacher had to contact me in regards to another student. I had to be on the phone. That does, has nothing to do with the fact that you're not doing your work, violating school rules, on your phone, what do you have to say for yourself? Look, look, there's all these other kids on their phones right now. When are you going to take anything? ownership of your problems and, and, and not blame others? Because everyone else is on their phone. Why do you got to point me out? Let's go to the office. I had enough of this. Bye. All right. So, all honesty, what do you think is the best country to live in? I think that Canada is the best country to live in. Well, I disagree because America, obviously, the best, um, has freedoms and therefore it is the best. So, okay, how you doing? I'm good, and you best for the rocks. No problem, man. How you been? I'm good. Oh, I'm just ready to go. Hello, sir. This is Special Agent Nick. Are you aware why I pulled you over today? No, sir. I'm not aware. Uh, you were texting and driving. Texting and driving. So I just cut the radio now. No, you were texting and driving. Can I see your license and registration? License and registration for what? We, uh, you were not even doing it. He was texting and driving. No, he wasn't. All he did was adjust the radio. If we were white, you wouldn't have put us over. Can you step out of the car, guys? No, sir. No, I'm not stepping out of nothing. This is unlawful, sir. I'm not guys, I'm going to need some backup over here. Backup because we black? Uh... I got a hundred dollars. Who has to figure out this magic trick? Hundred dollars. Oh, really? Okay. All right. See what you got, man. Right here. All right, man. We got this quarter. Right here. Okay. Well, I see how you did that, sir. You you put the doop to do on the doop to do, and then you let it slip out your hand real quick, so that way I want to see it. So, man. Hey! Hey, Jacob. What are you doing? How you doing? Good to see you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Cut it out, cut it out, cut it out. Something's wrong with this picture. Two men should not be hugging. When you hug, you turn gay. When you turn gay, you become a male prostitute. When you become a male prostitute, you get AIDS and you spread it around and you die. Alright, can I please come from the So good afternoon. Um, the essay I'm reading about is about the Big Bang Theory. But uh, I'm going to just share a little piece of it. So, boom, bang. The Big Bang Theory, right? It's the idea that science is the reason for everything. Evolution, eight animals, plants. It's, it's, it's the most complex but yet simple idea of mankind. And it's, it's, it's a lot of research that I've done into it has made this, this idea uh, come true. So that's just a little, little basis of mine. So. All right, if anyone has any questions, feel free to ask now. So you're telling me that everything that we have all this stuff in the room is, and everything else is just by one explosion. That's it. Yes, science, science proves it all. Everything that I said, you know, the Big Bang Theory backs that up. There's no way because God made everything, and th there, and that proves that man, because so it's God that made everything, not science. Shut up! Do you know what you're talking about? Yeah, I know what I'm talking about. God created everything we have. <laughs> well, the Big Bang Theory did. 
Kids, please stop fighting. Everyone's allowed to have their own opinion. But I'm right. How was work today? It was good. Thanks for asking. How was your day? It was good. Could have been better. Hi, honey. Hi. What is that on your arm? It's a tattoo. But we're Christians. Well, actually, she is a Christian. I'm not. You know, I just married her for her looks. But, but. I'm still a Christian. I just wanted to express myself through art. No Christian woman would do that to their body. That is not art either. I don't know who did that, but you need a refund. That is terrible. Shut up, Dad. The Holocaust didn't happen. What are you talking about? The Holocaust had to happen. It was the most, it's like the most documented event in history. It's so inhumane. No person on earth would ever do that. But there's like, there's video footage of all the that inhumane happen. things that happened. There's, it's, there's You're making, hey, 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 hey. You're literally making Hold it on. up. What are you two talking about? What do you think? What do you, what's your argument? The Holocaust is a real thing. Like, it, it actually happened. Okay, you seem to feel very strongly about this. Yes, and, I, uh, and I respect your viewpoint, so thank you. Zelma, what do you feel? What, what's your argument about? No person is that inhumane to put Jews into ovens and do all that to people that did literally nothing to them. All right, so you're saying the Holocaust happened. It didn't happen. And you're saying the Holocaust didn't happen. Hey, you two, let's get along. There's a happy medium here. The Holocaust happened a little. So, it happened, but not, you know, not as much as you're saying, but it happened a little bit. Now, are you both happy? No. Come on, you two, shake hands, make up. Oh, shucks. So, you know, I think I'm about to get this raise, you know. I've been putting in that work, a lot of effort lately. I'm, you know, I'm, when I'm on that computer, you be seeing me, I'll be punching away, doing them dispatches and expediting. And you won't be really doing nothing. That's why they're going to deduct money from your check. You're going to see it all on social security deductions from your check. Because I'm going to be the one getting the raise. I see you playing games on that computer. You don't see me playing no games. You see me be putting in that work. I'll be sweating bullets out here, baby, to make that money. <laughs> well, whatever you say. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. So let's talk about why we're all here in this room today. So, it's been brought to my attention that you two want to raise, ironically, at the same time. So, the question is, why do you two deserve a raise? Starting with the one who's always on their computer. I think I deserve a raise, boss, because, you know, you know me, you know what I do. I go in there, I put in my effort, I do my work, get it done, and I give you get present to you top quality work unlike my uh, comrade here who uh, does exactly opposite man so did you hear about that thing on the news oh yeah that's crazy you know you're never gonna do anything with your life right what are you talking about you can't say that to me i'm talking my class i mean i'm going places in life well your dad's a drug addict your mom had you at 16 so i don't think that you're gonna be much different so I guess you'll be flipping my burgers. You can't judge someone just based off their appearance. I'm going to prove you wrong. I'm going to show you one day that I'm going to do something great. Okay, show me where you're handing me my McDonald's. <laughs> so it's a beautiful cloudy day, folks. We got our first player of the year up, Deion Turner. He is out of game of 323 this year. Um, I'm passing over to my, my yeah. co -eater. Yeah, D, 323 batting average. You know, he, he did one four games in a row in this yes, past. Yes, he has. Past season, so I got a really good feeling, strong feeling that he going to take it home this game. Yeah, that's the goal. That's the goal, Jordan. Right. That's the goal. Yep. What are you people doing? This is such a bad influence. Oh, it's just a song. How can it be bad influence? How can it be a bad influence? You young people are going to listen to the words, and with these moves, it's going to get all sexual, promiscuous, drug usage. This is the root of all that. Hey, just because we listen to it doesn't mean we're going to do anything. It's good music, you just don't understand physical. You know what the problem with teenagers are today? All the problems with you people all stems from this dirty devil's music. I worry about all of you. Just be careful, kids. Be careful. I don't know if I can come in. I don't like dogs. Oh, he's okay. He won't hurt you. I got bit when I was younger. All dogs are dangerous. 
Do you guys see that? I think it's a UFO. That's not a UFO, stupid. <laughs> How is it not? Prove me wrong. We can't. <laughs> They're real. I'm real. <laughs> Those are your only two options. Well, none of this is there. Worst case scenario, she could be a stripper. Whatever. <laughs> Trump is the worst president ever. Why do you say that? Because he looks like a damn Cheeto. What's wrong with Cheetos? Hey, at least he isn't as bad as Nixon. Yeah, but he's racist. Well, Nixon was a liar and a scumbag. I mean, the economy has been going up since he's been president. But he's racist. Bro, why are you wearing that word shirt? You don't even watch basketball. Bro, yes I do. Steph Curry's my favorite player. What do you mean? You only like him because everybody else like him. No, I like him because they're a good team. Okay, so name three players on the word. Well, you know, one, you got Steph Curry. Bro, I can't think. I, yeah, I gotta look. You know, I, 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 I saw him yesterday, man. Thanks, man. <laughs> Sure, it can have some benefits, but that doesn't mean that it's good for you. It's a plant. It has to be healthy because of the fact that it's a plant. Cocaine comes off of a plant, but you don't see that being good. <laughs> over in a school zone and you just hit three kids on the way into the <laughs> school i'm sorry i just i'm on my way home to feed my kids because they've been starving for three days i work four jobs i don't have but, enough money to get ma'am ma'am are you aware you hit three kids are you aware that i have four kids I don't, oh, what's going on it, can you shut up shut up yeah um i'm gonna need some backup guys to no you don't need backup you need to let me go home to um, my starving kids I, I, I can't do that. I'm sorry. I'm, sir, I'm, sir. I'm gonna go run this. I'm sorry. No, I'll, stop. I'll 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 one. Shut up. I'll give you another one. Uh, I'm taking care of this. Wrestling is just an after school sport. Mr. Sauce said once you wrestle that everything in life becomes easier. That doesn't make any sense. No, he, Mr. Sauce said that. But. No, he, no, he said so. I promise. Okay. Universal healthcare is some absolute business. I'm getting tired of this. I paid them fools last month thousand dollars in down payment to get a knee surgery, and then they gonna put me on the donors or something. You gonna have to wait a few months to get your surgery done. Thought I put this one. What do you think of all of this? I mean, I think universal healthcare is actually good for people because the people that actually need it the most, you know, actually will get help eventually. Um, I guess I'll see your point. I want the American people to know one thing. I did not have sexual relations with that woman, Miss Linsky. Three thousand dollars in charges. Out of the blue, you spending three thousand dollars in charges, somebody that makes your wage explain yourself. You on something today, so you need to chill with that BS, bro. It's in black and white. Oh, black and white. All right, look, where your evidence at, man? Well, first of all, evidence number one right here, but you want to get into it? Okay, yeah. Explain yourself. All right. Look at it. Look at it. All right, Mr. Phony Bear. Man, what is this? This ain't even my signature, man. That ain't my check. That's phony. It's not phony. This is real. Okay. And you know what? I don't even know why I'm interrogating you. You know what? Outside of this, I know what you've been up to. Oh, really? I know what type of person you are. Oh, really? Oh, I know what you have done. What type of person am I? Oh. <laughs> we got your hard drive. We went through your computer. Oh, oh, you look at some pretty uh, 
unpleasant things there, sir. Uh, uh, how you gonna accuse me of what I'll be looking at on my computer? You hmm. didn't even graduate high school. Man, look, if you look, look here, you fat Italian bastard. <laughs> if you don't get your big wide as eight mile mother clip Willie set head ass on somewhere with this BS bro, I'm getting tired of this. Where we need justice. This is not justice. This is fake. This is not fake. You know what? This aside, this is hard evidence, but you know what? Your character speaks more than this. Somebody of your absolutely despicable character. You make me sick! You make me sick, sick. And you know what? I'll tell you what. People who confess get pizza. This is deep dish, pepperoni, sausage, bell peppers. People who tell the truth get pizza, even scummy bastards like you. So what do you got to say? Smell it. Smell it. All right, man. <laughs> you got me, bro. Yeah, I stole that money. I stole it. I embezzled that money. But you know what? I don't care, man. You want to know why I stole that money? I bought this two thousand dollar lightsaber for you, and you want to, you know, I know why you're mad. I'm gonna tell you why you're mad. You know why you're mad? Why am I mad? Because I'm getting more money than you, son. <laughs> That's why you're mad. <laughs> It just makes me so sad inside. All these children just walking around eating their spicy Cheetos and their unhealthy Bosco sticks. And it's just so terrible the way children eat and all these little fat children running around. They can't even get up the jungle gym because they got all these little ding dongs and chocolate and chocolate, this and that. And, and this, um, the donuts and these children just, they, they need to eat better. My God, this generation of just. That ugly children. Ah, uh -huh. appeal to emotion. That's a logic fallacy. You know, Kenneth, you're right. <laughs> that is a logic fallacy. Yes, indeed. Instead of stating my point that healthy nutrition aids in health and longevity, and that the we live in a very obese nation, perhaps I should have stated my point with evidence for the body mass index of young people and the dietary consumption during school lunches. I guess my crying and blubbering really wasn't the way to get a point across. Kenneth, thank you, good sir. Action. What's up, Ken? What's up, man? How you doing? I'm doing good, man. How are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Action. Man, I think I'm going to get that raise today. You know, I need that extra money. I put in that work out here in these streets. Hey, you know, I'll be busting my butt, putting in a lot of effort. So I think I'm getting that raise. I don't know about you. you they're going to take more money out of your check. That Social Security going to get up with you. I don't know. I see what you do on the computer. Oh, oh really? What do I be doing on the computer? No, I be doing that work. Making the... Good uh, afternoon. Good afternoon. Mm -hmm. So, <clears throat> the purpose of this meeting is to discuss why you guys and... Uh, should receive the raise. So let's start with the one who's always on their computer. Hmm? Computer doing what? I be on my computer doing my work. Put that. I, I gotta cut. God damn it. Action. Trump is the worst president ever. Why do you say that? Because he looks like a damn Cheeto. What's wrong with Cheetos? Well, at least he isn't as bad as Nixon, right? He looks like Spongebob when Spongebob went normal. 
Action. Uh, Trump is the worst president ever. Why do you say that? <laughs> he looks like a damn <laughs> Cheeto! <laughs> What's wrong with the Cheeto? Redo it, yeah, please. Like <laughs> <laughs> Action. Two thousand dollars in charges. Two thousand dollars in charges. Somebody who makes your wage. Yeah, look. I don't know what you're talking about, officer, but you long, bro. The evidence is very clear. I have seen your spending. I have seen it in black, white paper. How did you come up with that money? Where's your evidence at? Let me see. Where's my got? evidence at? Yeah, let me see your evidence, bro. My evidence? I have no, where's the paper? Well, there's the paper. Go back. Sorry. <laughs> All right, action. Hey, Jacob. Hey, Sass. How you doing? It's good to see you. you. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Something's wrong with this picture. What's wrong? Two men should not be hugging. When two men hug, you turn gay. When you turn gay, you start cold digging. When you start cold digging. <laughs> 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 what the hell? <laughs> Get in the camera. Whenever you're ready, Kenneth. Go. <laughs> Come on, Kenneth. Hey, Jacob. It's good to see you. How are you? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Two guys should not be hugging. Because when two guys hug, you turn gay. When you turn gay, right, you become a male prostitute. When you become a male prostitute... <laughs> Action. I have a question. Alright, go ahead. So you're telling me that everything that we have right now is from one explosion. Like, everything. Like you look around, you tell me everything is just one explosion. Yep. <laughs> oh, come on in. Back, 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 back. Oh, my God. <laughs> Action. What's up, man? How you doing? How you doing, man? How you doing? <laughs> <laughs>